What's up guys? Wanted to go over air pumps with you guys real quick just so everybody has an idea of what they should perhaps look for depending on price, like their price range, depending on um, the size of their setup. So I'm going to go ahead and go over these three different pumps with you. I actually have an additional pump and I'll show you that one last. All right. Going over the various air pumps you can use in your hydroponic system. Uh, this one I believe cost about $10. Picked it up from Walmart. It's um, rated for 30 gallons. And this one here is a step up. It's got two outlets for the air. And this one is uh, I believe 20. And this one right here is also the same. Um, both of these pumps are rated for 30 to 60 gallons and they both cost about 20 I believe I picked them up from Walmart this one also has dual outlets as you can see um, one important thing to remember whenever you're using these air pumps make sure you go ahead and pick up these air check valves this is to stop the water just in case something happens you don't want the water to come back up the tube and into the pump itself so Make sure you have these air checks. Um, specifically, depending on how many outlets you have, get an air check per outlet. Uh, put it before the splitter, though. Like, if you're going to split these lines, split the lines after the air check. These right here are not bad, but uh, they don't move as much air as I'd like to see through the tanks, especially when you get into the bigger tanks. Um, Depending on what size tank you're working with, you might want to look into something else, like a aquaponics type pump. Yeah, they sell them online all over the place. Um, some local hydroponic shops probably carry them as well. But these these are for like beginners. I mean, if you're just going to do a small little setup, like some five gallon buckets or a single tank, yeah, these would be fine. So this air pump right here is rated for almost 600 gallons per hour and um, this is the best I've found on the market. I mean for the amount of air that it pushes out and the cost, depending on how many tanks you plan on setting up, I mean yeah you can go cheaper. I think um, pumps, single pumps that do 30 to 60 gallons run about, um, about 10 to 20 bucks somewhere around there. But this one is about 25 I believe I paid 25 maybe $30 for it, and it does 600 gallons per hour. This is ultimately what I ended up going with because, as you can see down below, I have one, two, three tanks. So I needed something that pump out a lot of air because the other pumps just weren't getting the job done. So, yeah, that's really up to you. That's at your own discretion, but I would highly advise going with the pump that's like this in design. I mean it's better for price if you're doing multiple tanks. If you only do one tank then yeah like a cheap little ten dollar pump that would be perfectly fine. Uh, one more thing to keep in mind about this particular pump is the noise. I don't know if you guys can hear it in the video or not but it's actually pretty loud. Um, friends can hear it whenever I'm talking on the cell phone. That's why I'm glad this closet kind of muffles the sound but that's one thing to keep in mind when you're looking at this pump so if the noise is gonna bother you then yeah you might want to go with one of the smaller pumps the air pump that does like that treats 30 to 60 gallons of water yeah you might want to look at one of those it's quieter all right until the next video take care